Senator John Fetterman can now wear his signature shorts and hoodie on the U.S. Senate floor thanks to a change in Senate policy. Yes, Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer quietly made that change, telling the Sergeant of Arms to no longer enforce the dress code. And we have reaction to that change now from political editor John Delano. Leave it to Pennsylvania Senator John Fetterman, well known for greeting presidents in shorts and hoodies to help guide the United States Senate into a new era of sartorial splendor, or maybe not. In a statement to CBS News, Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer said that senators are able to choose what they wear on the Senate floor, adding that he will continue to wear a suit. I think that this most recent uh, move by Senator Schumer is clearly designed to you know, accommodate um, one senator, or you know, Pennsylvania's own Senator John Fetterman. Neither Schumer nor Fetterman has yet confirmed that this is the reason for the rules change. But David Urban, who was the chief of staff to the late Senator Arlen Specter, calls the change sad, saying Fetterman has worn a coat and tie on the Senate floor and in committee hearings and should continue to do the same. It is serious work that they're doing in the Senate. If, you know, you're not gardening, you're, you're, you're running the nation. Of course, dress standards have changed everywhere, from the office worker to the television reporter out in the field. And another former Senate staffer, Doug Saltzman, is not surprised. I don't know if it's exactly directed at him. There's been changes over the years. I mean, I remember instituting a rule in our office that you could come in casual on a Friday. Casual Fridays were a big thing. I always thought it was a big step years ago when the Duquesne Club in Pittsburgh, the Tony Business Club, you could be casual on the first floor during the lunch hour. But Keith Schmidt, state director for former Senator Rick Santorum, says the U.S. Senate should maintain the highest standards. You know, in an age when I know that's a slippery slope and there's a lot of changes going on, uh, two of the places where you still see a sense of decorum is in the court and at church. But, you know, if we're if these gentlemen and ladies are actually approving judges, they should at least live by that standard. I reached out to both Senators Casey and Fetterman on the policy change. No official response yet. Although, no surprise, Fetterman is responding on social media to some criticism from Republican politicians like Ron DeSantis and Marjorie Taylor Greene. No word yet on whether he'll wear his hoodie onto the Senate floor. John Delano, KDKA.